welcome hey. to our pretty cool vlog. Totally. Where we bring you things that we think are pretty cool. If this, uh, if this is your first time along, consider subscribing. That's one of the things that we consider pretty cool. Right now we're sitting at the pool at Pop Century. Pop Century. We're waiting for our room to be ready, so JR's enjoying the pool right now. Is it fun? <laughs> we're just gonna hang out poolside for a little bit. Yep. Hopefully our room is ready soon. We're gonna head over to the 60s pool. That's what we're doing. Look there. Roger Rabbit up behind us, standing tall and proud. Still waiting on our room, so we're gonna go over to that one. The other 60s pool, the pedal pool, because it's got a, uh, a drink counter. So me and Jessica can pass the time. So anyways, like JR said, here we are at the, I don't know if it's called the pedal pool or the hippy dippy pool, the hippy dippy pool. but this is in the, the 60s area. He's got these cool spray things. There's another one over there. So that's pretty cool. You know, people can hang out under that part. No one's there. No one's taking advantage of it. Fun fact about about water. Water is not wet, but whatever touches water is wet. But water is just water. I don't know why water is not wet, but whatever touches water is wet, so water must, must make stuff wet. You know, sometimes you just chilling out by the pool and one thing that would make it even cooler is if a hot babe came up and brought you an awesome drink. Whoa, what is this? It's called the Inferno. What oh am I supposed God. to do with this thing? It's a two-person drink. Good grief. I didn't sign up for this. And it's also not a kid's drink. This is definitely not a kid's drink. What is that? What I is took in a picture. There? Hold on, I can take a picture because oh, then boy. you can ask. Tastes pretty good. It's got oh, cherries, strawberry, pineapple, lime. It's called the Inferno. I'm not sure why. I thought it would be spicy or something. It's got um, habanero lime liqueur in it. Oh, maybe that's why. It's not spicy though. It's not spicy, but I can taste like the heat, if that makes any sense. Nope. Sometime later, we finally made it into our room. Looks like we got one of the updated rooms because this seems fairly updated, as you can see behind all of that updation. The updation. There's no carpet in here, see? Hard floors for easy cleanup, I'm sure. They got these nice uh, retro patterned uh, curtains. curtains. Those are cool. Got this area here where you put your stuff. You can hang your stuff up. Pretty giant TV. Giant TV all the way from there to here. From there to here. Also have the updated furniture. It looks very Ikea-esque. Very white and shiny. There's your safe. Extra pillow. Extra soft clothes. Drawers and doors. Oh, that's not very soft clothes. All right, lots of plugs everywhere. Uh, you got your little station here to put all your things. Uh, double coffee maker. You got your, your cool glass front fridge. Ooh, with neat LED light. That's neato. And there's a drawer here with some stuff in it. You got this really cool thing. This is like a, I don't know, a, a film strip pulling down JR's bed. There's JR's bed. It looks like there's a, a button. What does that button do? Nice. Oh. <laughs> I don't see anything. Boy. So that bed's pretty cool. You got Pluto sleeping. This wall here uh, will move out of the way to reveal the throne. It's very bright uh, LED lighting in here. 
decent sized bathroom. But keep in mind that the sink is in the same room as the toilet and the shower. Jessica is not going to be getting ready here where other people are doing what they got to do. There's the shower. And there's the old get up for the shower there. Got one of these handheld Duma Hickeys here so you can call people, talk to them while you're taking a shower. It's got these magnification mirror. That's pretty much it. There we go. The uh, updated Pop Century rooms. We're in the 70s building. So anyways, uh, that's our updated room that we got that we didn't know we were going to get at Pop Century in building 10. That's the end of this one. This is just real quick to show you where we're at and what we're doing. There's more on the way. So anyways, as far as we're concerned, that's pretty cool. Yeah.